Stealing Hearts Rescue is a nonprofit organization dedicated to rescuing large breed dogs all around Arizona. Director Tony Serapena spoke with us about her mission. The goal basically isn't to get every dog in a home, it's really more education about bigger dogs. People think that a pit bull or a Rottweiler one of the, is like, oh, that's a scary dog. And in general, that's not the case. But every dog, you have to understand the breed. So it's more, if you want a cattle dog, I want you to understand what you're going to get in a cattle dog and what you can't train out of. Pits, in general, are people dogs. They have to be close to people. So if you want a dog that's going to hang out in the backyard, you don't want a pit. You don't want any dog, really. But um, in general, I just want people to understand that just because it's cute doesn't mean it's the dog for you. Stealing Hearts was founded in November of 2015 and has seen positive feedback ever since. So Stealing Hearts is relatively new. I started in November. I've been doing rescue for about 26 years and everybody just kept telling me I needed to do my own. I actually wanted to have just a pit bull rescue, but that's not a smart way to go. So I was like, just stick with large breed. It's been going great. I, I didn't really realize how well it would take off, but it has. So it's been fun. I do not take owner turn-ins. Um, I have a belief that I'm not trying to help someone dump their dog. So most of the dogs that I get come directly from county euthanasia lists. So I go from Maricopa County, Pinal County. I also do Sholo, uh, Snowflake, Holbrook, those little places that have basically no shelters, and they come off of those lists. So when they're overcrowded, that kind of stuff. Um, for instance, I just pulled seven from Pinal. All of them were euthanasia dogs, and four of them are already adopted. All very adoptable dogs. It was just overcrowded. So the adoption fees are different depending. Um, for instance, like the senior dogs, there I just ask for a donation. Um, I do extra things for the seniors. Uh, a dog that is over a year is 160. Everybody's always spayed and neutered and microchipped, and then they'll have all their shots, and then the puppies are 200. And they're also spayed, neutered, microchipped, and their shots depend on their age. Stealing Hearts has three locations where the dogs are kept. Some are with Happy Tails Pet Service, while the rest are with Sarah Pena or volunteer foster families. Stealing Hearts puts an average of 20 dogs a month into homes. Volunteers and donations are what keeps it running. If you are interested in adopting or volunteering from this rescue, there are weekly events every Saturday at PetSmart Desert Ridge. Also be sure to check out their website and Facebook page.